Once the integrity of the device has been checked, it can be inserted using your right hand or your left hand, as you prefer, through the patient's mouth, in a blind way or with the help of a laryngoscope, as we'll show you in the next episode. To perform the blind insertion, follow the retromolar way, left or right. When you reach the palate, lean the tube back in order to ensure a straight way to the esophagus, which in this position stretches horizontally. Push the tube inside until the depth marks located on its body reach the level between the patient's teeth. At this point, you can remove the stylet and inflate the proximal cuff with 60 milliliters of air. Wait until the tube adjusts itself. As you can see, here it is coming out slightly. Once it gets stable, you can start ventilating the patient. Now that the spritz tube is placed correctly, it's working exactly like a supraglottic airway device. Next, we'll repeat the procedure with the help of a laryngoscope.